Hey guys, Thunder E here, and you are looking at the brand new OnePlus Nord. And I know there are tons of videos out there, but we're taking our first gaming look at it. It's not a gaming review, but just a gaming first look. Now, the OnePlus Nord is finally here. This is, of course, that device that we've seen that OnePlus is going to release. It's, now, it packs a ton of features, and let's take a closer look at what we have here. It comes in two colors. There's a gray onyx, and there's this blue marble. Really nice. I love the color of this device. And when you look at it right there, you can clearly see it's got a uh, you know, four cameras at the back. I'll just tell you this, same cameras as the OnePlus 8, so 48 megapixels, 8 megapixels ultra wide, it's a macro, there's a telephoto. That's pretty cool, but we care about what's under the hood, right? Because, you know, we're gamers. So it's got a Snapdragon 765G processor, so you've got, of course, some really great performance coming from that, and of course, 5G connectivity. Now, in terms of uh, RAM, you either get eight or 12 gigabyte variants, and you get 128 or 256 gigabytes of storage. Now, you're wondering how much it costs. We'll, we'll get to that in a sec. But that, of course, means we're gonna get a lot of performance, and OnePlus is always known for optimizing your devices to perform well. Now, you've got a single speaker at the bottom, you've got a USB Type-C port. That supports Warp 30T charging, which means the same fast charging we saw in the OnePlus 8, OnePlus 8 Pro, is here on the Nord as well. So I'm, I'm really excited to see what else they can do with this in terms of just all the functionality. But we flip this around and we come to that display. In display fingerprint sensor, which is nice, fast and responsive, but looking at the display, it looks so nice. We've got a nice, almost symmetrical edges all around. And you notice there's of course a dual front facing uh, cameras, dual punch cameras. One is an ultra wide, that's pretty cool as well. And has some really great features all around. But that display looks nice, 2400 by 1080p, but it's also a 90 hertz display. And we like to see that while we're gaming. So as gamers, that's what we care about. Faster refresh rates, all that fun stuff is on this device as well. And it's powered, of course, it's packed in with a 4,150 milliamp battery. So sizable battery for what we care about. But you know, before we even jump any further, let's take a quick look at some games that we like to see on this device. Again, this is just a first look, not a review.
So that looked pretty cool, right? I mean, the games looked like they just ran. And again, you know how OnePlus does the optimized software really well uh, altogether. Now, of course, they also sent us a few accessories. We've got a sandstone case, uh, you know, regular sandstone. We've got, of course, a blue marble look colored sandstone and a clear case. And there are a few other cases around for this device. But I want to know what you guys want to see in terms of games and what else you want to see in the gaming review when I drop that for you because there'll be a bunch of things. But also OnePlus announced its brand new OnePlus Buds, which will have a video on that specifically, but that pairs in pretty well. And you can see the color that, you know, that our Onyx color looks really nice with it as well. Uh, so we'll take a good look in a separate video on that. But I want to hear your thoughts. What do you guys think about the OnePlus Nord, right? We've seen uh, it packs in a lot of features. Uh, we've seen, of course, that, you know, games run really well on there. And what games should we be playing so you guys can get the full extent of what the Nord has to offer? I'm excited. Oh, oh, oh by the way, oh, if I forget, sorry. Pricing, right, yeah. So you see the pricing on screen right here and you're going, man, that's, that. yeah, that's that's affordable. That is really affordable. And if I if I convert the, the pricing, uh, the Indian pricing to the US, that comes up at $400 and $500. So this is a $400 smartphone. Can you believe that? 400 bucks. Woo! I can't wait for it to come to the US. I know right now it's it's uh, gonna be available in certain territories, but this is what we have been waiting for as Android fans. So I can't wait to fully test it out. Again, this is just a first look, guys. Gaming first look. We'll give you, of course, more videos on the OnePlus Nord, so stay tuned. If you have any questions or any comments, let me know. Otherwise, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and always enjoy your entertainment.